Hi, we are learning Code Igniter, and in this part, we understand custom routing, right? So let's see the example and understand what is custom routing. Custom routing is just like you need to make your URL is better, right? So you can see your site name, and you can see contact us controller, right? So we want this URL as a contact contact us, right? We need to make our URL like this, so it's a it's a pretty good uh, for users to see your links on a search engine, right? And when we click services, we don't want to some capital letters it here. We want it to a services services, right? And hit enter, so it will show a error message, right? So it will show error message. So let's fix it, right? Just copy this name, whatever you will type it here, right? Uh, services my services my services right whatever you need to change uh, in URL right so just copy this name whatever you are typing it here no matter just copy this name and uh, just let's go to our project this is my project CI series and these are the files and folders of my code igniter so let's go to application go to views and go to header right just header just take it here and drop it here right so this is the services controller right so this is we we want to when we click just go back and when we go click on a services we, we don't want to like this right services we want to add url like this services services right we want our url like this so just copy this name and paste it here right so we have a pasted because this is the services link right and what next we need to do right just go to uh, roots just go back right go back just go to application go to config and go to roots.php right just drag this and drop inside our code editor right just let it zoom in so you can see clearly right and here you need to type a comment so we can um, understand uh, later so this is custom routing right and we need to copy this and paste it here just remove this right and here is your controller name right so controller name just go back back this is controller right just open services services controller just drag and drop it here and we know that this class is a services controller and we we well know right the class name and file name should be match right should be same right so we need to copy this and also you can copy this name services controller and go back to routes.php and paste it here right and and we need to change our url as a services right just copy this and paste it here right and this is also you need to paste in your header right so this is the services just paste it here and just let's refresh right so it's work right when we click home and when we click on services it looks our url is pretty good right and it's a uh, um, it's a, it's a um, it's a uh, for seo right search, search engine optimization so user can um, interact your website well right so about us we need to change this one as well we need uh, we need about us like this uh, type of URL we need at this time it's page not found right just copy this and go to header so just paste it here right and we need to go uh, roots and just copy this one as well right and paste it here and here is our controller just remove this and here is our controller name so at this time we we need to for about us just copy right and paste it here right and this one about us this type of URL we need just copy and paste it here right and this is you need to copy uh, in header right I have already pasted it here just paste and refresh so you can see it's working when we click home services URL is pretty good and click on uh, about us uh, URL is uh, well right so we need to make for contact us as well right so now you have understood about this right this is called custom routing just paste it here and here is just remove this and just remove this here is the controller name so we want to for contact us just copy and paste it here 
and this is for contact us right so contact us we need a URL like this right just remove this contact us we need a URL like this contact us copy and we have paste it here and this is a uh, contact us and paste it here and let's refresh so you can see click click contact us our URL is pretty good right so this is called custom routing but the problem is when we pass any URL right so public we are creating us in a services right uh, this is the services controller right services controller dot php you can see services controller dot php and when we create a new function right so public function and uh, we need to services as a php uh, web development right web d e v e l o p development right and uh, we public function okay web development this you can camel guess web development right and here you need to pass uh, uh, some uh, uh, some parameters it here right so I'm passing a uh, PHP comma HTML comma CSS right CSS right so this are we need to when we route about these right uh, so how we can do right just let's uh, let's first uh, understand just first uh, run this project right just copy this right and just paste it here right and uh, hit enter right so services controller at this time and we because this is uh, by default it runs right and the next thing is we need to call this method so just paste it here and it will take a three parameters right too few arguments to function right so we need to pass a parameters right one two and three right so first parameter is php first parameter p php second you can type it um, my php right we are passing some parameters in a web development in a this function right so php you can type anything uh, HTML and CSS we need three parameters like this right so if you type one two and three parameters and hit enter so it's a nothing showing an error but this URL is not good right it's not good the this is the method web development right and uh, this is a controller right this is controller services controller so we want this URL just like uh, services S E R V I C E services and uh, services web and uh, we need to pass PHP and we need to pass HTML and we need to pass CSS right we want like this of URL right so how we can accomplish this right so let's go to your routes.php right and here we need to copy and paste it here and here is your controller name which is services controller we are talking about services right so just paste your controller name right because this function inside a services controller right so I'm typing it a services controller then we need to call a method just forward slash right and call the method which is web development just copy and paste it here and then forward slash and put three dollar signs right dollar one for first parameter right first parameter dollar two dollar three right so dollar two and dollar three dollar mm, three right so it means this URL means uh, whatever it has uh, PHP HTML CSS whatever it has right uh, you can understand about this and here is most important thing I will teach you uh, teach you here right so here you need to type your controller name which is services right we have a rename it 
con services ctrl to a services we want to uh, this type of url so just copy these right and uh, in a single quotation mm, in a single quotation you need to paste it here right and put it forward slash and then we need to pass uh, we need to web php html and css right so web right so activate uh, okay services just remove this right p we want services php html and css right we need to like this so what we want to do that let's uh, right just put it brackets right put it column and int for integer values right so we want to type anything right so put it any any means any ca any characters means one two uh, like this one like this one two php right and uh, dollar air and php and uh, dollar php something like any means anything right so this is for first and also just forward slash this is for first parameter just copy and uh, paste it here and forward slash and paste it here so first second and third right if you have a fourth parameter you need to again dollar and dollar uh, dollar four this is for four pa fourth parameter right it here but we have a uh, three parameters in a method right so we need to pass only three parameters so we need to uh, we have a done uh, this type of URL right so when we refresh right it's a uh, nothing showing a error at this time and you can copy uh, you can echo all of that echo echo Mm, php dollar php which is this one php mm, okay this php uh, dot and put it a br tag right and semicolon just copy three time two times copy paste and paste right so this for html just copy paste css just copy and paste right so just refresh so you can see php html css right so i am putting it web android development android mm, d e v e l o p m e n t android development it had hit enter so you can see android development html and css right so here is the web development web d e v e l o p m e n t web development hit enter right so our url is is nice and looks pretty good and it's a for search engine optimization right css programming pro gramming right so you can see so this url is uh, good and uh, it's uh, for seo right so if you like uh, this video you can subscribe and if you have any questions and doubt you can write a comment uh, in a comment section so bye take care